Hey guys, this is Cynthia Maynard here today, and I have a Michaels haul for you. Um, I hadn't been there in a while because you know how it goes. <laughs> you have to watch what you spend. But they also had a lot of clearance stuff. So, um, and it's all stuff that I'm going to use or am running out of. Clearance this Heidi Swap spray, and um, I use a lot of spray inks. Um, and I'm running out of a lot of colors, but I didn't have this color. It's like a dark navy. And you can see at the bottom the mica uh, is there settling at the bottom. And it's this beautiful navy color from Heidi Swap, Color Shine. So that'll be fun. And clearance for $1.49, which is an absolute steal. That's even cheaper than the springs at Tuesday mornings from the Tattered Angels. Um, so this is a Recollections Michael brand um, in cherry. And so um, it's got got the pigment ball in there. You can hear that. Um, so I'm excited for that because that's a color that I don't quite have. They also had in this sort of recollections aisle, um, they have these like bins. <clears throat> they had a spray ink um, with their new color splash line. And this is a purple. It's kind of a brighter purple. <laughs> I like my sweater. Uh, with the mica you can see there, so it's going to be like a glimmer mist. And it's two fluid ounces. So it was 20% off of $7.99 for that. Um, also they had these smaller bottles, one ounce probably of the bohemian sort of line that they have and uh, I had gotten the other set and I just loved it so this is the other set that they have with the pink the orange and the sort of yellow gold and you can see the mica on the bottom there uh, I had I'm, I don't have a lot of washi tape so I got just a couple rolls of washi tape one was the bohemian line or boho I keep saying bohemian but well, I guess it does say Bohemian on there as the alternative language. Um, so anyway, the Boho line from Recollections, um, and you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight washi tapes that like are pretty thick. So that's going to last me a super long time. So that was 20% off of that. Love those colors. Anything orange. Most economical uh, thing to do. And again, this is, you can see how thick they are. Um, some beautiful florals that are in right now. Some um, geometric shapes. Uh, good old diagonal stripes. Um, some like folk art type of um, watercolory esque uh, patterns. And of course, a nice polka dot. So these just all go really well together. And they're different widths as well. So that will give lots and lots of options. And that is recollections. I don't have a lot of lace, which is really odd because <laughs> I'm a seamstress and I have like a whole fabric store in here and I don't have a lot of uh, lace um, trim for some odd reason. I don't know. You can color it with your inks, which is nice, or leave it the way it is if you would like ivory. So that was pretty cool. Um, oh, forgot about this little washi tape guy. Some three of the regular recollections again. Um, some great colors there that are going to be very, very versatile for me. Hopefully you're seeing these in the light here. Uh, some nice mustardy yellows and things. And nice shapes. So I had these Recollections bows, which are very shiny and glaring, um, for only $1.29. So you get six pieces. You get two large ones and four tiny ones. So those will be put to use. I got the silver as well as the purple and white. And those were the only two that colors that I would probably use. The sticker there was only 49 cents. I love these shapes because I do a mixed media a lot and you could put these on things, canvases, or put a picture behind it or flowers coming out of it. And so these are very uh, versatile and you can paint them if you don't want them that color. So I got that as well as some of the regular dollar ones. This nice ornate frame. This um, also this frame and then my favorite one this guy of course the stickers on the back there but just love all that fine detailing I got some brads because I got plain ones because you can oftentimes uh, I will add things to the top of these you can see the little tops um, they're just simple brads um, but when I make flowers and such, I'll put stickles on the thing on them or cover them with 
you know, emboss them or paint them. So I like having something just versatile that I can do whatever with. I needed a one inch punch and this was cheap with bitty swap masks, stencils, whatever you want to call them. These are more masks. Um, Mr. and Mrs. So that will be good for the wedding season here, making lots of cards and you are loved. And so you simply put that on there and you can paint or texture paste or spray through and lift it and it will be there. So that was that. And those weren't very expensive. And then this one says, yes, please. And thank you. So again, um, they had something new there that I was pretty excited about. Because again, with the mixed media, they had these um, sort of wood veneer shapes. And you get quite a few in the package for um, not very much. I think very pretty, sturdy, paintable, or lead as is, or use as a tag. Uh, lots of things you can do with that nine pieces in here these pretty flower shapes so three of each shape and they had a ton of choices I just picked the three that I thought four apparently <laughs> uh, that I thought would be the most, most versatile for me but they had words oh, five <laughs> um, it says celebrate and you get three of those these birds very cool the detail is just really really nice. And I love clocks and time, so these are all clock related. Oh, yeah, this. Um, this is from, again, the Recollections Color Splash line. Um, it is a resist pen, so I'm excited to try that out. We'll have to do a little review and video with that. But um, Oh, two more things. Um, one was they had a ton of these jars with all different things. They were all very tempting, but again, I had to get the thing that I would use personally. Plus, you can use the jar, so that's always fun. And the string. Um, got a ton of little um, shapes, geometric things, um, uh, mathematical things, Indian-looking things. Again, the whole boho sort of wood veneer cut out shapes types of things all sorts in there and that will be a lot of fun I can make pattern paper with that um, just background stuff whatever but very versatile they had tons of different kinds and you just had to pick <laughs> can't get it all and the last thing here I thought I would try I saw somebody else do this um, this roller and I don't think I would invest in a ton of these because it, I prefer regular stamping, but I thought these shapes were just really intricate and neat, and uh, I wanted to get that. So it's got this one, and then you can change it out for this sort of leafy thing with the border. And then there's a third one in there as well, so I'll have to do a little review on that as well. And that's, again, the Boho from Recollections. They have tons of neat stuff that's just, you know, not name brand, but... Um, so I love, I love Michael, so that was my swap for today, and uh, thanks a lot for watching, guys.